Your love is like the ocean tide Steady as the wind and fierce as fire Jared, on July 25th, 2020, at 12.24 a.m., I wrote down a prayer to God about my future husband. I am excited for the future knowing you have someone greater than I could ever imagine. I hope one day I get to read this to him. Roughly six and a half months later, God delivered every single thing in my prayer. Molly Stewart, falling in love with you has been the greatest gift God could give me. A man that has a thousand encounters, traveled the world, and experienced so much. Something was missing. It's now evident why God made woman. You truly complete me. I have waited so long to find the person who would be my spouse. You exceed my expectation. You are kind, giving, compassionate, protecting, witty, humble, selfless, honoring, res respectful, but most importantly, Christ-like. There's not a single doubt in my mind who I want to spend the rest of my life with. You are my backbone, my motivation, my rock. I strive every day to be the best version of myself for you. Well, today we celebrate how wide and long and high and deep the love of Christ is. And we want to know this love that surpasses knowledge, that we may be filled to the measure of all the fullness of God. We have come together here in the sight of God and in his presence of his, of his congregation to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. 1 Corinthians 13. If I speak in the tongues of men or of angels, but do not have love, I am only a resounding gong or a clanging cymbal. If I have the gift of prophecy and can fathom all mysteries and all knowledge, and if I do have a faith that can move mountains, but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give all I possess to the poor and give over my body to hardship that I may boast, but do not have love, I gain nothing. Now we will do the lighting of the, of the unity candle. As you enter marriage, may the light of his presence in your life and his works through you be seen as a light in the darkness. May the Lord unite you with one faith, one hope, and one love. May you, Molly and Jared, be one in name, one in aim, and one in commitment to the one and only true God. Molly and Jared have consented together in holy matrimony and have pledged their faith to each other. I now pronounce them husband and, and wife. Those whom God has joined together, let no man separate. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss your bride. <laughs> may I... May I present for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jared Bauer. I got some swag when I step in. <laughs> and my hands keep clapping and the way keeps lifting current flow to my body. In more serious note, Jared started to talk to Molly uh, a couple years, or talk about Molly a couple years ago. And he told me about how he had met somebody that had the same 
values and beliefs as him, and that he couldn't, he really couldn't handle having to go back on the road and be away from it. And I'd never really heard him talk about something like that. And uh, he wouldn't tell me your name. And, and I was like, okay. Yeah, it was like two or three times we talked about it. And he finally said, well, Dan, her name is Molly. Okay, well, for those of you that don't know, my wife's name is Molly. And Jared and I have been very close for a very long time. I thought he was pulling my leg, right? Like. I thought to myself when we got back, I told my wife, he's gonna marry her. And that was only like since February. And then they came back later and I said, Jared, you're gonna marry her, aren't you? He says, I think so, Dad. <laughs> excited for the many adventures to come. I'm excited that we will get to make a lifetime of memories together being the best of friends. I just love how instantly you and Will hit it off. Um, still a little bitter. Will got to play golf with Jared before I even got to meet him, but I'll let it go. Congrats, Jared and Molly. We love you guys. Congratulations. <laughs> so happy for you guys. Congratulations. Molly, you look absolutely beautiful and stunning. Jared, you're a lucky guy. Okay. I'm Natalie and this is... I'm Kelly. And we just wanted to say that we are so excited for Molly and Jared and we love them so much. We love them and we just wish them a million years of happiness. You guys are the best and we're just so excited for you guys. I'm so excited for y'all and so happy. This is the best day for y'all and the best day for us because now we have Jared in our friend group. Congratulations to Jer Jared and Molly. Two wonderful people with good hearts and a lot of love for each other. And I don't think I can say much more than that. They're very intelligent people and I love them both. Congratulations to you, Molly and Jared. So happy for you and it's just wonderful to be here celebrating with you. Thank you. So, uh, Jared, Molly, uh, congratulations. You had the best wedding official I think you could possibly have and you're a beautiful couple and uh, I wish you many, many, a lifetime of happiness. Molly and Jared, we're so happy for you guys and we're having so much fun at your wedding. Congratulations. 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 We love Congrats. you. Congrats. <laughs>